topic of this video is identifying polynomial functions and their degree. Let's go ahead and solve this problem. All right, so we have f of x equals 6x plus x to the negative 7. A polynomial can only have exponents that are counting numbers, x to the 1, x to the 2, x to the 3, never negative. So because of this negative 7 as the exponent on this x, this is not a polynomial. Okay, g of x. Uh, this one is also not a polynomial, and the reason why is because of the exponent of x here. Remember, the exponent of x has to be a counting number, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, etc. It cannot be a fraction like 2 fifths, and therefore this is not a polynomial. And that brings us to our last one, capital F of x. All right, so capital F of x is a polynomial. Yes, a polynomial. And the reason why is because we can write it in a form that matches this statement. And here's how we would do that. So first our constant term, which is 8 ninths. 8 ninths is a real number, plus there are no terms where the variable where the exponent on x is 1, so I have 0x. There are no terms where the exponent on x is a 2, so I have 0x squared. For the x cubed, the coefficient is negative pi. Pi is a real number, therefore negative pi is also a real number. And for my x to the fourth, oh, there's a little bit more space here. my coefficient is 2. So all of my exponents are counting numbers, 3, 4, those are both counting numbers. All of my coefficients are real numbers, 8 ninths is a real number, 0 is a real number, negative pi is a real number, 2 is a real number. Therefore, this meets the definition, and capital F of x is a polynomial.